A harmful situation spilling into the Willamette has Corvallis City Councilors forced to make some quick decisions. They're trying to fix a problem and state officials brought to their attention. Covering Benton County tonight, News Source 16's Angela Brower shows us what the problem is and what City Council is hoping to do about it. State officials have told the city of Corvallis that some of the wastewater spilling into the Willamette is actually harming some of the endangered river life around here. Now the city is spending thousands of dollars studying a solution. Many fish that uh, inhabit Northwest rivers, um, with water gets above a certain temperature, their their breeding does not work, and, and I don't know they may also just die. While city council members don't know all the science behind the problem, they do know why they're willing to address it so quickly. It's not as if uh, this is a, an elective decision on the city's part, but rather a requirement, and we're trying to find the most cost-effective way to meet that requirement. The city essentially has no choice. The Department of Environmental Quality believes the water going from the wastewater plant into the Willamette is too warm in the summer, and if it's not fixed, the city could be fined hundreds of dollars per day. City Council has narrowed down some solutions. Now they want to answer the community's questions. This treatment system is part of the waterworks budget and so that would come out of fees that are charged to uh, citizens on their water bills. One alternative would be to pipe treated water to artificial wetlands, cooling the water as it moves through subsurfaces underneath the Willamette. It would cost about 14 million dollars. Will it work? You know, measuring the, the porosity of the soils, uh, taking a look at the kinds of issues that might be associated. What will there be settlement problems? Up next for City Council, a meeting to move forward with one specific solution. Solution, but it will take community input to do so. In Corvallis, I'm Angela Brower, News Source 16.